What's going on Spartans? We're back and today we are doing an extended play showing some high level gameplay pushing to 4k. I'm actually past 4k now but want to show this gameplay to you guys throw some music up and of course ask you some questions. I uh, just got back from Montreal actually and had a lot of fun there meeting Gameloft and a few of the YouTubers that were going out there to see him also. Um, but main thing I want to ask you guys is this Friday, I'm going to let you choose the upload. So what do you want to see? Do you want to see Boom Beach? Do you want to see Rival Kingdoms? Do you want to see more Clash? Or do you want to see uh, World Zombination? You choose the upload, and I will go ahead and basically make that video tomorrow and see which one gets the most votes in the comments below. So let's start out, show some awesome attacks, and then we'll throw some music up and come back at the end to finish commentating. But wanted to play this awesome new song I've been doing a lot. And uh, it's really a good song. Hopefully you like it. There'll be a link in the description if you do. Download it. Enjoy. It is a free song to download. And it is from Monster Cats and from a bunch of other websites. So very good. Obviously, we're going from the left side of this base going in. And we're kind of going for that multi-target Inferno to start out. And that's what we're basically aiming for here. So the golems are in. They've actually targeted the big bomb there, which is good. Taking out this uh, Air D and, of course... The Archer Tower, the Clan Castle has been activated. And the reason I attacked from the side was that it allowed me to get that multi-target Inferno locked down with my Golems. But also, it allowed me to draw out the Clan Castle and kill it, which is very important. And, of course, the Queen's Podiums on this side. So those are the three main things you need to focus on. And my King gets targeted here, which is really bad. So I throw it on the free spell, Enrage the King, and he's back up to full health and just kicking butt. And we're in the middle of this base. The queen is going to town. She's just chilling that jump spell, though. Just kind of in the wall, actually, which is kind of funny. But the king is going to die soon here, which is bad news. We do get the town hall. And we have a ton of golems left. This is wild. I made one mistake. I should have dropped down two wizards on that cannon up to the left top corner there um, when the golems are still in range because it was distracted. But now it'll cost me a few troops or else my minions to kill it. Uh, the queen is dead. No. Bad news, but we already have the two-star. That's all I care about. And, of course, pushing a 4K was really fun. If you missed my 4K episode that I announced it in today, I was at 4,055, and I went ahead and posted that today on Clash Army. So go watch that. This is kind of a late upload. Sorry about that, guys. There'll be another video tomorrow, and then, of course, throughout the weekend, there'll be videos. So definitely make sure you vote on which you want to see, whether it's Boom Beach or whether it's World Zombination. I really do want to hear uh, what you guys want to see next. So obviously, we're going to go ahead and throw some music up and enjoy. I'll be back in a little bit to finish commentating. See you guys in a minute.
hopefully you guys enjoyed that song and those attacks. We're going to get one more in here. And, uh, yeah, so been doing a lot of crazy stuff lately. I'm going to have some vlogs up. Obviously, you guys are going to see the vlogs first. I might throw them on the Clash Army also. I haven't decided. I don't know how vlogs are doing on the main channel, but I do think that I want this channel to have everything on it because I really do enjoy vlogging once in a while. Letting you guys know what I'm up to, being as interactive as possible with you guys is really important for me, especially, um, obviously, commenting on every comment you guys pretty much post. God, I cannot talk. Jesus. Anyway, but the bottom line is just trying to stay interactive with my fans, and I will be giving away a Skype call soon, so stay tuned for that. There will be a giveaway for that. I don't know how I'm going to do it, but we're deciding. That was a really shitty free spell. Sorry, guys. That was really poor. I could have actually gotten all four of those defenses. Instead, I got just the Inferno and Expo. Pretty bad. But we should be able to pull this one off. The King is on the Town Hall. He's enraged. And the Queen is helping out here on the edges here. Oh, no, King, go back. Finish off the Town Hall. What are you doing? Oh, my God. Thank God his Barbarians knew what to do because they saved the day and got the one star. And my Queen goes down 44%. Let's see how we pull this one out. See if we can get that 50. I think we can do it. 46% though, we're getting close, I ha oh my god, that, if you looked at the actual health on the storage for the elixir there, that was so low, I can't believe I didn't get it, I should have dropped down my troops now, um, when the golem was distracting things, but I didn't, so 47%, and we don't get the 50, one trophy only, pretty common up here guys, so yes, I have been hunting down a lot of trophies, and I've been getting a lot of single trophy wins, um, I really don't attack single trophies unless they are Town Hall Snipes, because it's just not worth it. I'd rather search for three hours and find someone worth 30 trophies or 20 trophies and earn a ton. Because if I do all my troops for one trophy, I can only do six attacks every six hours while boosting, which costs about 300 gems to boost for that time period. In case you were wondering, it does cost about 300 gems every six hours to stay up here, because um, I do play six hours a day. So I spend about 300 gems per day, maybe 500 if I do spells faster. Uh, but that's about how much I'm spending. Not spending a ton, but definitely staying up here and enjoying it. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching. And as always, love you guys. Peace.